Do you want to turn your PowerPoint presentation from ordinary slides into a cinematic experience that grabs everyone's attention? Get ready because this tutorial will level up your presentations by 100. First, we start by setting up the scene. Right-click on the slide, Format Background, and choose Picture Fill. And insert your image. Then open the Effects tab and change your picture effect. I want to increase the blur. I usually set it to 20. It softens the background and gives it a clean minimal look. Now insert the same image again through Insert tab. And adjust it to cover the entire slide. To make the scene more attractive, add a rectangle shape from Insert tab. Then choose Gradient for Fill. After that, Set the direction to vertical and darken each spot via brightness bar. After that, I increase the transparency of these to the spot to see the background behind it. Then remove the outlines. Now let's create the effect that instantly makes your design look premium. The glass panel. Insert a new rectangle from Insert tab and Shape. And set the exact height and width. And remove its outlines. From the Fill option, choose Slide Background Fill. Now this shape works like glass and shows whatever is behind it. To make it more realistic, add another rectangle on top and apply a subtle light gradient. These two layers together create a modern glass effect. Now, let's add a subtle details that make his like look professional. Part 3 Adding Details Insert a line and from right menu, set its width to 7. Exactly like before, apply a gradient that matches your slide's color palette. This might be the last time you see one of my videos, so before we continue, make sure to hit that subscribe button below. Group both shapes, duplicate the glass panel, reduce its width, duplicate it again, and shorten the height of both shapes. Then place both of them here. and add your text. With the main elements ready, it's time to build the next slide so everything flows smoothly. Part 4. Designing additional slides. Using the same structure, create your second and third slide. Small variation between slides make the final transition smoother and more cinematic. Final part. Adding a morph transition. Now it's time for the magic. Select all the slides, go to Transitions, choose Morph, and then from Effect option, select Characters. This setting delivers incredibly smooth professional movements across your slides. And that's it! This is just one of many slides you can create with this technique. If this tutorial helped you, hit the like button, subscribe, and turn on the bell so you won't miss the next high-level tutorial. And remember, PowerPoint isn't just a tool. With the right design, it becomes art. Next week, next trick.